guys know it's gold. It's Chris here. It's babyface Chris here. I I shaved too much. I did not mean to shave off this much. And I look like a total douchebag with this hat and this no facial hair. I look terrible. Welcome to a react video to uh, one of my old video series I did called Unpopular Opinions. Now I did two of these. These kind of like transitioned into my in my opinion videos. So basically this series was about me listing off a few things that I had an opinion of that were considered unpopular. Hence the title. And now I'm going to be commenting on these things uh, here and there and seeing how I've changed and just kind of calling myself out. Now remember, this was 2014. This was six years ago. I was 20 or, you know, roughly 19 or 20 at this time. And obviously six years is a long time and I was a completely different person. Whatever I say in this video, take with a grain of salt. Obviously, I'm, I'm going to be commenting on it, but I'm over explaining. Let's get into it. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Chris here. And, um... This video is all going to be about unpopular opinions, specifically mine. Who else's opinions? I heard this opinion and I want to sh And it's pretty easy to understand the concept of this, so here we go. No oh, dude, all right, real quick. You can hardly tell, but like there's my old Blackville Bride's tattoo, which is right here. And then there's my old like noodle outline, which is right here. And tattoos, it's pretty man. easy to understand the concept of this, so here we go. Number one, Batman and Superman are my two least favorite superheroes. They're stupid. I hate them. So, Batman and Superman, least favorite superheroes. They're stupid. I hate them. Now, very clearly, I had no real experience with Batman and Superman at the time. And even still, I have a very, very little experience with Superman. However, Batman, I've gone through... Uh, the Bat the Dark Knight trilogy and I've watched like Batman Beyond as a kid and the Batman cartoon and stuff and obviously and, and of course like Batman and Superman not my favorite superheroes I don't really care that much I never got the hype behind Batman granted the movies are great but I never got the hype behind him and I definitely still have a very sour taste for Superman because I can't get behind he's kind of like Goku in the regard and obviously comparison but he's like Goku in the regards where he's just undefeatable like uh you need you need superman to literally bend the universe in half he can do it. It, it i just can't get behind it it's lazy it's boring rap and country are easily my least favorite genres of music if i hear either one of them i cannot stand it so first off i i also want to comment on just the audio quality is horrible Maybe it's just my headphones. I don't think it's my headphones. The audio is terrible. It's absolutely fucking filthy. And also, my opinion here was country and rap are the worst, are my least favorite genres of music, and I can't stand listening to it. I still agree with that with country. Country is dog shit. I, there's not a single country song that's good. But rap, I'm getting more into some rap. I'm more like like dropout kings and some just like very... I like raps placed into other genres of music, not straight up rap. Eminem is probably one of my least favorite artists nope though that's i respect true. him i hate yeah. his music no he's definitely not my least favorite there are a lot there are a lot worse mumble rappers i have much more respect for eminem now but i still don't have a single eminem song on my ipod there are some songs i will listen to though if you're gay if you're a homosexual that's 100 percent okay with me okay. do whatever okay. you want it's your life i have no right to tell you different and it doesn't bother me in any way at all. And I don't care what the Christians say. You do you. <laughs> the Christians you thing. The Christians thing was a joke. Like I don't care what the Christians say. It's it's that's a stereotype. But uh, I have like I have like some schmutz on my fucking monitor. Uh, but yeah, no. If you're gay, I don't care. Still stand by that. You do you. To take your own life, commit suicide, then that's your choice. No one has that's to, a to stop you. It's your life, not theirs. Even though. You're probably only causing more harm than good to yourself and to everyone else around you. Though you feel like no one's there for you, it's still, it's not a selfish decision, in my opinion. It's selfish for the other people to force you to stay here in a world that is miserable for you. But it's also selfish on your part, too. It's selfish on both ends. So, it's your choice, but I don't recommend it. To reiterate what I said, suicide, you have the only right to take your own life no one else can decide that for you and that but in doing so you cause more harm than you do good then again is it worth your suffering to keep other people happy that you're alive that was my, my opinion was you're allowed to take your own life whereas i still 
um, stand by that in a way. Like I do agree that like if your life is just that absolutely tragic, then you are the only one with the right to decide your own fate. However, I am a firm believer, uh, being on that side of the spectrum, having been there myself, I am a firm believer in just keep trying, just keep waiting through the days, and if you don't give up and you actually persevere, then you can make life worth living. If you're dead, how do you eat pizza? Airsoft is better than paintball because airsoft feels more like a war simulator and not a laser tag kind of game. But they're both fine. I just prefer airsoft over paintball. I think it's superior. I still agree with that, Jonas for sure. Brothers, not that bad of a band. Disney Channel kind of ruined it. I'm a but sucker for you. They're good guys. Don't be hating. Anime is better than 90% of the serial TV shows out there. I wouldn't say 90%. I mean, I'm not one for sitcoms. I'm not one for dumb comedies. I'm not one for crime shows. And I'm definitely not one for modern cartoons like Adventure Time and stuff. I, I never cared for it. I wouldn't say anime is better than 90%. Maybe anime is better than 70% of most TV shows out there because you still have some fucking bangers. And I don't really watch a lot of TV. Honestly, I really don't watch shit all for TV. But, you know, you got Supernatural. You got Breaking Bad. You got... That's about all I got. I'm sorry. I, Seinfeld, Always Sunny, and... Most of the shows like that, I hate. I never will watch them, and I think sitcoms. And, fucking and yeah, no, nah, I agree. Gorillas and Corn are the two best bands of all time. That's not an opinion. I mean, I guess that's an opinion, but it, I was just basically trying to say that I love these two bands. Sasuke is a horrible character, and I hate him. Nope. Sasuke, oh my god, okay, so Sasuke is definitely not a horrible character. I don't hate Sasuke anymore because, uh, I mean, yeah, he's very flippant in how he decided to, basically how he was changing sides all the time and how his emotions would switch on a dime and just, Sasuke's not a horribly written character, but he could have been handled better, but he is, the whole dynamic between Naruto and Sasuke, I don't need to explain it to you guys, that was just a, that was just a dumb take. Goku is the best male protagonist nope. of any show ever and he is a god no one can defeat goku fuck you superman you suck like goku's definitely not the best male character of any anime or anything he's absolutely not he is a very shallow character because dragon ball is a very shallow show when it comes to how the characters are written they're very archetypal and they're very just stuck in their molds for the most part and they're not complex, so... In Final Fantasy X, the main character you play as, his name is pronounced Titus, not Titus! Titus. It's Titus. Eat that's not an opinion, that's a fact. You can see I'm trying to be, like, I knew that I was, this video was going to get negative attention from people, and I am going to check out the comments for these two. But you could tell, how am I at 10 minutes recording of a 2 minute video? So you could tell that I was trying to be very um, aggressive to people, like trying to put up the statement, of, I was trying to put up the front of just like, Whatever opinion you have, I don't care. Get it away from me. Kind of things. I knew people would argue with me, so I was being very flat, very angry, very emotional. Supernatural Season 5 is by far the best season of the entire show. I still the worst agree with that. season I'd have to say is probably 6. I didn't like it very much, but it was, st it was still good. But 4 and 5 are my two favorite seasons. The worst season was... For season 10. Yu-Gi-Oh! Dude, this is before season 10 was out. They're on 15 and we're on a hiatus right now. Uh, I definitely don't think season 6 is. It's one of the worst seasons for sure, but I still think 3 is up there. 3 had a lot of good stuff, but it was so dramatically cut short because of the writer's, uh, the writer's uh, strikes, so I don't know. Yu-Gi-Oh! is 100 times better than Magic the Gathering. Yes! Now, this isn't a fanboy thing, but I prefer Xbox to PS3. Even though I grew up on PlayStation, I prefer Xbox because of the layout the dashboard, the controller, the marketplace, navigation, and we used to have better exclusives except we're whoring ourselves out the PlayStation, so that kind of sucks. The best I agree. Call of Duty of all time is Modern Warfare 2, hands yep. down, second after Modern Warfare 3. My eh, Little maybe. Pony is not a bad show. I've seen three episodes. I would watch it if I had time. Three episodes for My Little Pony? I'm not, I can't, I'm not gonna back up that opinion because I can't form an opinion on a show based on three episodes. My boss just texted me and told me I can come in an hour later if I want because we're slow. Yes. How bad was that fucking audio quality, dude? Listen to that again. He just texted me and told me I can come in an hour later if I want because we're slow. Yes. 
Jesus Christ, what was I filming on? You guys get a bonus opinion because I actually- How did the quality just get better? Hold on. I want because we're slow. Yes. You guys get a bonus opinion because I actually was editing and I just remembered this one. The Walking Dead Telltale Game Season 1 and 2 are infinitely superior to the TV show. 100% agree. TV show was good. Nah, as soon uh, as they hit the governor yeah. arc, I mm -hmm. started to hate it because the yeah. governor was just... That's about all I can think of right now. I'll probably do a part two at some point, but uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and uh, leave me a like. I really appreciate it. While I'm watching this video, all I can sit here and think is, how does anybody love you? You are so miserable to look at. Okay, well, anyway, so I do agree with that last opinion, by the way, that the games, uh, the walking telltale... Wa Telltale Walking Dead games, I cannot talk, I'm fucking tired. The Telltale Walking Dead games are far superior to the TV show, even now. What do the comments say? Two of you! Thank you, Shannon Kendall, five years ago. One of mine is I really think DBZ should have ended after the Frieza saga, and that they're probably the other So yeah, 17 likes, two thumbs down, September 12th, 200 views. Not bad. Let's go to number two. Number two. Whoa, number two is fucking ten minutes long. Oh, crap, dude. Alright, I, I already expect a lot of this, not going to comment as hard. But Hello let's... everybody, it's Chris here, and uh, welcome back to part two of Unpopular Way better Opinions. quality. If you haven't seen the first part, be sure to click the first link in the description below where you get to hear me go on and on about things that I like or don't like that is pretty much the opposite of what the general I miss that sweater, is, dude. That was a sick sweater. Well, or as I understand it from the internet. Now this is part two, here we go. Number one, I have an extreme dislike for peanut butter. I cannot stand it. It is the most horrific, absolutely I still agree. disgusting thing I've ever smelled or tasted. I remember I felt so cool because the way I filmed this, I had that one light source casting a deep shadow outline right here, which looked terrible. Uh, so I added a, I added a shadow outline, a drop shadow to the peanut butter text to make it look like it fit in with my filming. It's mm. fucking disgusting. Ooh, let's Thank play. you for letting me know I have an email. It's disgusting. I cannot stand weed. Marijuana. Pot equals no. Uh. I can't stand it. I just lost internet. Shit. Uh -oh. I cannot stand marijuana. Does the internet it trying to take me down? Me off. I, I still agree. The fact by the way. The, Fuck you, Pot. I'm not going to entire... The entire attitude nice cut. of pot smokers. Jesus. And I, have a, I don't drink and I I don't... Alcohol I more like no alcohol. Just, sorry. I see the freaking point i don't i still agree i don't, I don't like drink alcohol. don't see I the point my pants a bit less severe than the other ones i was just talking about um my favorite season is fall i like uh you know as opposed to summer and everyone <laughs> wanted to you know go out and go crazy swimming and hang out in the sun and just be with friends or partying whatever <laughs> why did i do I that the fall because it's quiet it's calm it's like it's so fucking dumb walk around in short sleeves or t-shirt if you want and it's just all together. It's oh. nice. It's beautiful. It smells clean. Still Air agree. Smells good. I love the fall. The fall is great. Now get some gamey stuff in here. I prefer Modern Warfare over the Black Ops part of Call of Duty. The joke is Cod Duty versus Warfare. Cod. I just I. Uh, this one is also gonna strike some people as uh, just right in the chest. As I don't <clears throat> like Star Wars. I and I've never that. seen Star Trek. I, Halo is my only space I'm love. To say fucking hate star wars i i am changing this opinion now because i don't hate star wars as much as i am oversaturated with star wars i am overexposed to star wars media it i have a habit of developing um just disgust towards things that i'm overexposed to so star wars got pretty much the full brunt of the overexposure i have at this point i hadn't seen anything more than like one movie of star wars and now i've seen all of them except for han solo story and rogue one as of the recording of this video and as well as like a lot of the animated ones and i haven't seen mandalorian yet but i've seen like the nine movies uh and the first animated clone wars i think so i can say that i do like star wars but i am tired of its media influence and its oversaturation i hate 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 how obsessed people are with it i'm so tired and that uh, too i get tired of people it doesn't star suck. wars sucks only the new opinion. trilogy but whatever you know like what you like i'm not gonna damn you for liking it i just just don't talk to me about it i fucking just Leave me out of Star Wars. No, I'll talk about uh, Star Wars. Let's hey, go. Hey, Mr. The Rock, I like Vin Diesel better than you. You're yeah. You're annoying and stupid. Rock sucks. And sure smelly. smelly. 
Now versus you stink like sweat. versus porn. If you don't know what hentai is, it's porn for anime or just cartoon porn. Hentai is far superior on my list. Yeah, most days, Way sixty better, forty. It's art. I appreciate the art aspect of it, which Plus, is also very yeah. true. Plus, here's a list of actresses that you all love. That I like how he prepares you for a list, and there's like three on I here. I can't stand. Jennifer Lawrence, Mila, Mila Kunis, sorry, Angelina Jolie. Those three, awful. I don't find. What is that text actors. displacement? Like, what the really fuck is that? I don't care much for their acting. I was purposefully sure, they have talent. I couldn't act. Making the text just, terrible. I don't by see the way, the appeal. I don't see how they're so which doesn't come so off very well. Popular people. They're just people. And I know yeah, I, I, I'm not big into celebrities, I, I and I'm not big into celebrities in general. Like, I don't have favorite celebrities, and I don't have, like, celebrity crushes, and I don't have, I don't really give a shit about most, like, movie stars and TV stars for the most part. Uh, but I definitely don't understand the idolization of a lot of the female stars or the male stars in general. Like, I just, I don't care. When people ask me who's my favorite actress or who's the hottest actress, I don't have an answer. Another thing with uh, famous people is Jonah Hill. I... I have an inexplicable hatred for Jonah Hill. I can't. I can't describe it. I couldn't really tell. Yeah, you. I it's don't just, know. I see his face, and I want death to take him. I, I want to not, hurt Jonah Hill physically I and I just probably hate emotionally. Jonah fucking Hill, so much. He makes me mad. He's my human version of marijuana. I didn't mention it before, but marijuana is simply the topic of it. Just makes me mad, and I just don't want to talk about it because I'm just, I just fucking hate it. It's just one of those things. It doesn't make I me as do mad like now as I just get to the point, just like, yeah, I'd rather not talk about it. I don't care. It's like feminism, or <laughs> it's like feminism, animal rights. <laughs> <laughs> I was the making last jokes. Thing on my list, I didn't have a super long list as opposed to last time, but and yet somehow the video is nine minutes long. Um, here's a list of movies that you may have really liked that I can't stand. I thought were all awful. Black Hawk Down, mm. uh, Battle of Los Angeles, mm. The Hangover, and uh, <laughs> Hunger Games, and I think it was White House Down, or no, Olympus Has Fallen, that's what it was called. <laughs> all those movies. All those movies are fucking all. steaming Down, garbage, dude. looking at it like this is retarded. Of course, Hot trash. I can't say I would have done anything better than it. But I no, I'm saying right now, I would have made a better movie. Give me give me a budget. I'll make a better Black Hawk down than you've ever fucking seen. There'll be twists, there'll be turns, there'll be actual hawks. I was lied to. There was not a single fucking hawk in that movie outside of a goddamn helicopter. I want hawks with bandanas and M60s. I will make this happen. Give me a budget. How do you guys like my new background? It's nothing special. It's just I my videos are always like this. And the background is always a blurry mess of... How do you like my new background? It's a fucking white here. sheet hung from the ceiling. Back then, I wasn't making nearly as enough money or as much money. I didn't have bills, but I also just wasn't making nearly as much. So I wasn't investing a lot of stuff. Plus, back then, this is 2015, a lot of, like, you know... Um, filming and stream stuff wasn't as mainstream as it is now, so it wasn't as easy to find, or there wasn't as much information based upon like backlighting and backdrops and stuff like that. So I didn't really have a lot to work with at the time. So I often missed these days because they were so simple and bad, but they were genuine and they were just authentic in what I was trying to do. And you know, I like the working with what I have type videos. I don't really always care much for super professional. Uh, videos like just like fine-tuned to the very nth degree of perfection videos I don't care for those they they seem artificial to me so I do like videos like this that's why I often go back and watch old videos like this because I can appreciate the effort that I had to do to make them with what I had so yeah watch it again for the hundredth time and I'll see you guys in the next one trying too oh, hard was. later, later. alright so to top this off, 175 views, not as well received, but about the same amount of likes and dislikes. So personally disagree with a lot of this, but the hen but that hentai point was great. Long sleeve pants, 78, five years ago. Uh, and feminism point, okay. I didn't even like or comment. I might, I guess I must have missed it. Uh, Taco Bell, interesting. A lot of these I agree with, especially Bell from Fort. So yeah, that's it for a reaction video, guys. Um, if you want to see, again, the series that this that uh, basically was spawned from unpopular opinions. Check the link in the playlist below. Check the link in the description down below. It's 1.53 in the morning, dude. I'm, I'm so tired today. I don't know why. I'm stupid. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you.
in the next video. Bye-bye! Markiplier outro never gets old.